Welcome back to our channel for yet another episode. Thanks for joining us, guys. Um, so today's video, I actually I've been meaning to do it for for a while now. I've, we've, time has just not been on our side. Uh, we've had antics. We've had a few matches. We were traveling for. Uh, we actually had our own URC matches that we've been managing and building and and attending and. The business has really been busy and I need to thank each and every single one of you out there that's been supporting us. It really means a lot to us that you guys support a small company uh, like us. Um, it really means a lot to us. So thank you guys. We do appreciate it. The video today is all about the Apex Rival, the 4 to 32 by 56 but a quick rundown on Apex Optics, especially for those in South Africa uh, for whom I'm actually doing this video because Apex Optics is brand new in South Africa. Company based out of Canada, they are mainly made up of PRE shooters. They compete and their goal behind this company is to deliver high-end products, high-quality products, products that shooters out there are asking for and that they need at a fair price. Um, and these guys, I must say, since the first shipment of Apex uh, products landed in South Africa, they've put their money where their mouths are. It's awesome. Um, from the moment you take the box, you unbox it, uh, you start using it, it is, it is awesome. Now, we've also got their binoculars. Um, they've got one binocular, the Apex Summit Pro, the 12 by 50 That has got super, super clear glass, but also a rotating milling reticle. Uh, I will be doing a video on that, uh, not today. Today will be all about the Apex Rival. Now, when I first laid eyes on the Apex Rival, I think it was on a YouTube channel, I knew I had to do more research on it. Um, I did what I had to do, I watched some videos and I got in contact with Apex Optics and I have been hassling them for probably close to a year to see what we can do to get this specific optic in South Africa. And the reason behind that was I wanted to, to get an optic into especially South Africa that punches with the likes of 60, 70, 80,000 Rand optics out there, but below the 50,000 Rand point mark. So in South Africa, currently, the Apex Rival, 4 to 32 by 56, um, it retails for below 50,000 Rand. And that is what I wanted to do. Is is an optic, you, you take it into your hands, everything feels great, everything sounds great, and when you look through it, everything works. And this is what this optic does. Now, I've had some time behind it. Uh, I actually recently also shot a match, a local Pretoria Precision Rifle Club match. Um, came in second in that match, which I was very happy with, and I ran the Apex. I did it so I can feel it in a match, see what it does, um, test the reticle, test the glass, and I am super, super impressed with this optic. So, to give you guys a quick rundown of, uh, on the, the rival, it's a uh, like I said, a 4 to 32 by 56. Um, I'll see, hopefully the camera can pick it up. But you guys can also visit our website, www.fanaticgear.net. They're on there, um, we're selling them, and there's a lot more detail on it there. But main features, it's got a 34mm tube, I'll get to that just now. 56mm objective, it's got 32 mils of... Um, Total elevation travel, it's got a zero stop, it's got a dial indicator on the elevation turret. And this specific model, it's got 15 mils per rotation. Now, I'm not exactly sure, I think they probably will um, in future either a different turret or maybe send out a, a different model on the Apex with a 10 mil turret. I think the 15 mil per rotation on the turret is very cool for especially your 2-2 long range shooters, your PRS 2-2 guys, the NRL guys. Um, you don't have to go out of a full rotation uh, when you when you run your, your setup. Whereas a 10 mils per rotation might be more suited for your PRS style guys. Now, when I said I'll get to the 34 mil tube, the thing that attracted me about the Apex Rival is you guys know I made a video about the Leopold Mark 5 HD and I felt it's very underrated in South Africa. And the main thing about the Leopold 
in South Africa that makes it a little bit tricky is the 35 millimeter tube. So ring and mounting options on that is very limited in South Africa. And if you do find it, it's quite expensive. Whereas with your Apex rival, um, and sorry, the reason I'm actually comparing the two is they're in a very similar price point in South Africa. Um, I'll give you a quick feedback on, I've, I've tested the two of them up against each other, but where I feel the rival might beat the Leopold is, is there's about two or three main points around that. Now, the first one is like that, your Leopold's got a 35 mm tube, 34 millimeter tube, there's just a lot more options, especially in South Africa, um, affordable options, that's just high quality, high standard, you guys can actually go and check on our website, um, there's Stealth Precision uh, 34 mm rings, that's two and a half thousand rand. So that's a, that's a big, big, big plus point for me. Now, the other one, and I am a massive fan about this, is the turret. So hopefully you guys can hear it, but um, I really, really love an optic where when you touch the turret, there's basically no play in it, and it's extremely tactile. So hopefully you guys can hear that. And when I put this next to the Leopold Mark V, and again, the Mark V has got very, very good turrets, this was a clear winner. And that's probably the two main things on this optic for me that makes it a better buy in South Africa currently with a new brand in South Africa. The glass is super clear. We've, we've matched it up with a bunch of other optics out there. You guys know I'm a massive Carlos fan. I shoot Carlos myself. We've compared it to the Carlos scopes. We've compared it to Vortex. We've compared it to the Leopold, uh, the Delta Javelin, which I think is also a very, very good optic at the price point. We've compared it to the bunch of them and they punch right up there. The rival is right up there with glass quality. And one of the main attractions on it, I think, is the CLR reticle. It's a, a reticle for the rival itself. It's a, it's a super clear reticle. It's also very similar to your Leopold Mark V. A reticle I think a lot of PRS shooters um, appreciate and it just works for them. And it's, it's been working great in this. And guys, everything on this optic is just, it's solid, it works. It's a very good looking optic. And like I said, at a price point below 50,000 Rand, I really do think, especially in South Africa, this is going to be probably one of the biggest new high-end optics. Um, like I said, it's a 4032 by 56. When you open up the box, uh, let me see if we can maybe quickly do it um, and get it for you guys out there. So not everything's in there, but you've got an extremely nice cutout foam section. It comes with a sunshade. It comes with a already installed throw lever, flip caps. So there's no additional extras you actually have to go out and buy. And uh, it comes with, uh, as Apex will say, a, a lifetime warranty, the, the Apex Oath that you will most probably never have to use. And it's good. It's good if a, a company backs their products. So hopefully it was informative, especially for those in South Africa that does not know Apex Optics, that's not really seen the Apex rival. We've had them at matches. You guys, when you see me at a match, more than welcome to come over, come and chat. Come and take a look, feel it out. But it's really, guys, it's, a, it's an awesome optic. It's, it's got super, super good turrets. It's got super clear glass. The, the reticle is, is just awesome, especially for your PRA style shooters, your 2-2 shooters. And um, it's also a, a very, very good optic option for long range shooters with the 32 mil of total elevation. You guys can visit our website, www.venaticsgear.net. The rivals on there, other Apex Optics products are on there. We will be dropping a video on the Apex Summit Pro, the 12 by 50 with the rotating milling um, reticle. It's I've used it in probably three matches now already. It's actually in this little bag, awesome bag that comes with it. Like I said, the accessories that comes with the Apex uh, Optics, the um, the product. Sorry about that. It's just it's awesome. They they give you a lot, a lot of value for money. Now I've I've used this binocular in a few matches and wow, it's it's made a difference. It it really does assist you to actually have a binocular you can spot with 
that's got a, a reticle uh, built into it but that will be in our next video so thanks for joining us today guys if you've got any questions uh, regarding the apex rival you can drop it in the comments below you can go and visit our website you can email us at info at fanaticsgear.net and for those of you that got my number um, you know where to find me so thanks for joining us and we will see you in the next one